Hi, welcome back. We're here again, another It's Wonky Studio vlog. I'm Jamie and I make pottery and I've been doing so since 2021. Um, almost officially two years since it's, wonky, since it's Wonky was born, which is awesome. And this week I'm glazing and prepping for a pop-up that I'm having in a couple of weeks. Right now I'm going to edit some photos and input things into my POS so that once I get my pieces finished, I just need pictures for them. It's doing all the basically boring but necessary stuff of like what the item is making categories so that when it is pop-up time i'm just quickly clicking away very carefree and getting it all done without stressing thank god it's march because february was not great for me i don't know if you've watched my videos before but if you look at any of my videos from last month everything was going fine until it wasn't and um yeah my kiln failing really just through a wrench and everything and so I feel like I'm still recovering from that and my pop-up will not be what I had hoped because of that so just trying to find some wins and a bright side but having a hard time being a creative and making art and trying to make a living off of it are all very different things and all are all very challenging things and I'm learning that. I am so incredibly grateful, just got goosebumps at the thought of the people in my life who have been sad with me and been there for me and just like emotionally cheering me up, uh, sitting with me and just saying it sucks and it's hard and not every step of the way is shiny and bright. And I think that's a good thing because life is, it would be pretty lame if life was just happy all the time. I am respecting my frustration and my sadness, but not sitting in it for too long to where it keeps me from actually moving forward and doing what I love and doing it in a way that does bring me joy. So hopefully this week will be a good one. <laughs> I'm going to channel all the good energy and do what I can to make it a good week.
I know that there are people in the world who leave their house without their hands full, but that is not my life. It has never been my life. And at this point, I'm starting to think it never will be my life. Okay, so in my last video, I mentioned how a lot of weird place things happen when I took my last batch to the firing studio, but I did not show those weird issues. So basically, there was what I think is crawling on a couple of things, these two green pieces, and then there were two that I put like a crackle glaze on, but I just didn't put enough, so that was me, not the kiln. And same with these like yellow ones, I sponged it on, but yellow is not the color to be sponged with the clay that I have. That's on me. Bubbling on the inside of things, mainly with my clear glaze, but then there's also, I got a new like underglaze, but it looks like I just brushed it on. Like it like as if it didn't even get fired at all. And it makes no sense, but it caused one piece to bubble and then one mug to just look weird. So I'm going to try and paint transparent on top and see if that will help. And then just add more glaze to the ones that I didn't in the first place. And then glaze the actual things that I planned on glazing today because I forgot there were so many that had issues. I am meeting a friend for coffee in, well, I need to leave in an hour if I want to walk, which I do. And yeah, until then, I'm just doing some admin things. I have a couple of invoices to send out for some commissions. And then what else do I need to do? Update all sorts of sheets and things. So yeah. I will be here doing that until I need to leave. And it is so windy and nice outside, which I'm so glad because I'm trying to be a walking girl more. The studio called and said I can pick up my bisque wear and I'm so excited. I was hoping to have it yesterday, but this will do. I just got back from meeting my friend with for coffee and I walked and it is so hot outside. I don't know what I was thinking. Gonna pick the pieces up and then glaze like I've never glazed before so that I can make sure they're done and back to the studio by Monday, if not Tuesday. So really cutting it close. Am I overwhelmed? Yes. Am I literally on fire because Florida is so hot? Yes. And now I must go. <laughs> Thank you. 
your day and I am off to take a walk and then come back and keep up at the glazing. I'm gonna try and finish everything I brought upstairs today and then take those downstairs and bring up the other box of stuff and finish those tomorrow. Let's see if that actually happens. I have returned and now it's time to glaze. Happy Sunday. I just finished glazing and it's just now 11 o'clock so I spent the past like two and a half hours doing that and I am excited to see how everything turns out. A few of the things I like pivoted the plan that I had for them which I'm glad that I did because I do think that I will love them. Uh, today I just need to organize the rest of like my pop-up plans uh, just on paper as far as like table and all of that stuff because next week while those are getting fired I'm gonna prep the actual like setup and typically I just do it very basic um, a lot of the bins that I use I just carry the stuff in and then use them as shelves on the table but I do have more plates and bowls and like bigger things than normal so I just kind of want to draw it out and get an idea so that if I need to buy anything next week, I can do that. Also getting interviewed. So we're going to chat about my little baby pottery journey and that should be fun. And then tomorrow I will drop those pieces off and wait probably till Friday to get them back. my 
interview. Catherine was lovely and I'm so honored and thrilled to be able to chat about what I've been doing. It just made me that much more excited and yeah, grateful to be doing what I'm doing and to kind of relive it all in one fell swoop was fun. It's been a wild ride, but I regret nothing and I don't want to be anywhere else. And that is a wonderful feeling, <laughs> even on the hard days, which I've definitely had as of late. I'm so happy. So I'm going to go to the coffee shop, get a bevy and chill. Back from the coffee shop. Lovely little afternoon. I was importing some pieces into Square for the pop-up. So I feel a little bit ahead of the game there. Always got to be thinking ahead, right? I'm going to edit some stuff and then make dinner. 